Hey guys, welcome to ITS Tactical. I'm here with Nathan Dunney from DRT Ammo. And uh, we went hog hunting last night. He brought me out here to Spike's, Spike Box Ranch in uh, just outside of Seymour, Texas, Benjamin, Texas, actually. And what we what I bagged last night was about a 175 pound hog. Um, it's a boar. Um, I was able to take it down. Um, I've got an MMP 15 here, which is what I use. It's got an AAC can on it. It's also got a um, D750 from Night Optics USA. Um, I will speak to this just a little bit that I don't think I could have made this shot. It was about 200 yards, the shot I took. Um, I do not think I could have made it without this four power uh, magnified night vision optic. Uh, I think if I would have had a PBS 14 head mounted or even weapon mounted, I definitely wouldn't have been able to make that shot. So um, I was able to take him down. I was aiming, you know, just behind the shoulder and I went a little bit low, but it still took him down with one shot. So um, I want Nathan to kind of talk to you guys about the, uh, the terminal ballistics behind that and why this was, why I was able to do that, honestly, because I think uh, a regular 5.56 five, round would have ripped right through him, right? Yeah, absolutely. You know, um, with, with hog hunting becoming so popular now, you know, this is a great way to introduce our product in a, in a live fire situation uh, where we can go out, we can, we can test the equipment, whether it's the night vision or the... Uh, the ammunition on on pigs uh, so that you can not only address it for a hunting situation but also for uh, self-defense and things of that nature we can get some real world feedback here uh, basically what we've done with our bullets is what we use what we call powdered core technology we replace a solid lead core that has a copper jacket we replace that solid lead core with our powdered core so we take powdered metals um, we use some copper we use some other proprietary metals and that powder starts as fine as makeup powder. We compress it into a solid core and then drop that inside a copper jacket. So a lot, the big misconception with our ammo, uh, using the word frangible, is that it's just a, a powdered bullet, when in reality, uh, we just replace that core and we still use a copper jacket. By doing that, what we have is when the jacket rips off, we create a gigantic permanent wound cavity. And when we get into the pig, you'll be able to see that wound cavity. Um, the first thing that I noticed here is you don't have an exit wound. So from a terminal ballistic standpoint, we have 100% energy dump into the target. And then from a, uh, a self-defense or a law enforcement standpoint, there's no exit wound, so you're mitigating risk to innocent bystanders. Uh, that round is designed to delay two inches. This particular 55 grain, 223, is designed to delay two inches before the jacket rips off. That's uh, particularly important uh, with pigs having that, that front plate that everybody talks about so that we penetrate the bone, we penetrate that plate, and then the jacket rips off and causes all the damage in the organ cavity. Well, I will say he only ran about 20 yards, which I think is pretty awesome. Um, he didn't make it very far. I did take a follow-up shot, but I'm not sure if we hit it. We're going to find out once we uh, get to cleaning it. So, you got anything else you want to add? No. Th thanks for having us. Absolutely, uh, man. You know, I appreciate it. DRT has been a big fan of ITS <laughs> for, for a long time. So. Yeah, Nathan and I have known each other since uh, class we took a few years back. So, it's been cool uh, him inviting us out here and getting hands-on with the product. There's nothing like testing ammo, like shooting live live tissue, right? The am <laughs> you know, I don't think I'll ever hunt hogs again without night vision. Once you do it like this and you hunt in a team yeah. and uh, and you can use some of those tactics that we you know we train on uh, on the shooting range, it's it's a lot more fun, a lot more of a, a real world uh, a practice. Yeah, know? absolutely. Well, let's take a look at this pig, man. 